The Bible mentions many creatures, some of which we know, and some of which we have never heard of before. Let's revisit the Bible, and see more about these mystical creatures. Number 1, The Hoopoe. Leviticus chapter 11, 19. If we look deep into the African Sahara, we'll find this bird with a crown of feathers. The hoopoe, was once, considered sacred in ancient Egypt. You could find them carved into the walls of temples, and tombs. In the Torah, or Bible, hoopoes were listed as, detestable, and shouldn't be eaten. This may be due to their diet of, large insects, and reptiles. Number 2, Kite. Leviticus chapter 11 verse 14. Kite birds, are birds of prey. With keen sight, and a detestable diet. The Bible most likely is referring to the red kite. Red kites are found all over Palestine, and tend to eat dead animals, along with insects and earthworms. Number 3, Asp. Deuteronomy chapter 32 verse 33. The Bible describes it as, a venomous snake from Egypt. Most likely, this snake was the cobra. Worshipped by Egyptians. You can see this on King Tut's head. In films, Asp is portrayed as very wicked, and powerful. Asp is mentioned five times in the Bible, and all represented evil, venom, and wickedness. Number 4, Leviathan. Isaiah chapter 27 verse 1, and Psalms 104 to 26. It is unknown if the Leviathan is a giant sea serpent, or merely a large crocodile. But there is one thing for sure. It was big enough to call monstrous, and it lived in the water. No one seems to know whether this creature was created by God. Or Satan. Number 5, Pit Locusts. Revelation chapter 9 verses 3 to 10. In appearance, the locusts were like horses prepared for battle. On their heads were what looked like crowns of gold. Their faces were like human faces. The Bible states that the power were like the torment of scorpion stings. Number 6, The Basilisk. Isaiah chapter 14 verse 29. The Bible describes a more beastly creature. 
a cross between a rooster, and a serpent, that can cause death with a single glance. The basilisk of today, is quite different. While it still has the body of a serpent. It also runs on water. They are also known as, the Jesus lizards. When threatened, they can drop from a tree, and into the water, sprinting upright, about 5 feet, per second across the surface. Number 7, The Behemoth. Job chapter 40 verse 15. It is unknown whether or not the behemoth was a beast, or dinosaur. It is, however, mentioned as a plant eater, with strength and force in his body. The scripture pretty much describes any plant-eating dinosaur with a strong body and slow-moving tail. The book of Job is also the oldest book in the Bible. So it is very possible that dinosaurs walked the earth around this time. But we can't be too sure. It could have been some other creature. Every creature that has ever walked this earth, shall be loved and cherished. Forever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 